thing I love is just coming in the morning and being one of the only ones awake on the ship. It's so quiet. morning and welcome to day four of our Disney dream vlogs today we are in beautiful Castaway Key um, actually the boat is currently turning around and parking itself in reverse which is very impressive those of you who do not know Castaway Key is Disney's private island you can do so many things on this island 5k run lookout um, snorkeling Stingray, petting, paddle boats, kayaks. There's just pretty much everything. There's even a kids club so parents can go to the adults only part of the beach. Barbecue, characters, and it looks like we're gonna have perfect weather. The sun is rising and it is just beautiful. Castaway Key, redemption for last year. Beautiful day. Last year was cold. Is our home for the day these two chairs and these two chairs Ryan's already ready to go snorkeling I might have to go with him the kids are out there swimming I was just sitting in the sand Mike's enjoying his lounger and I think I'm going snorkeling with Ryan hopefully it doesn't burn my eyeballs Thank you. 
You never know when you're going to stroll up to a impromptu Disney dance hall. Chips, fruit, bunch of salads. I got way too much food. I'm probably not going to eat all this, but I was kind of hungry for a cheeseburger. And this looks so good. This is like, I don't even know. It's like a cherry bread. It was so good last time. Cherry? Yeah. No, I don't know. There's... Maybe it's raspberry, it's some kind of berry, and it's like pink in the inside. I think it's all raspberry. Mm -hmm. So good. Salads and bags of chip for later. Ashley got the ribs. Ribs, because there's no pulled pork. Ashley's disappointed. There usually is pulled pork. And I, I got a real southern meal. I got my ribs, my corn, and my cornbread. <laughs> Ice cream to oh, go. No. Oh. <laughs> oh no. This one's harder. Oh well, it works. Last time my ice cream looked like a gnome, but this is awesome. I've improved. It's harder ice cream, that's why. The one on the ship, it's always so soft because I think everyone eats it so fast. Oh, but they yeah. have to put cream in so it like pours out fast. But this is a perfect ice cream cone. Ice cream. That's a pretty big ice cream. If only it was not white. Good you. Ashley's also shopping for a hat. This is the hat she needs. Looking good. Mom, this is that Mike says you would look good in this. Let's try it on. What'd you have?
now we are back from the island. We are sunburnt. But we had an amazing day. We had gorgeous weather. Way better than last year. Way better than last year, Ryan says. Um, and now we're waiting in line for bingo because that is the only thing we haven't done on a Disney ship and Ashley really wanted to play bingo. So we're in the lineup for pre-sale. Okay. But more importantly, I am your bingo host, so you can just call me the bingo girl. In the G column, it's G58, G5 and an 8, G58. Shake it up, Betty. You tell her, shake it up, Betty. Is the outfit of the day a little maroon dress, a little black flats? Mike's looking pretty snazzy himself. <laughs> Now it's defying the kids. <laughs> Dude, check it out! It's like a big human tank! A truffle parse sets. I did order a soup as well, but everybody else got their soup. Butternut squash soup. Ryan, what kind of soup did you get? Potato. Potato. It's like a big potato. Kids got some Caesar salads. Delish. Happy birthday to you. Got the herb crusted pork chop. My God. Uh, pork tenderloin. Oh, pork tenderloin. Oh, there. <laughs> Ryan got a baked potato and the pork chop. He didn't want the tomato risotto. And Ashley got pasta, but it's not here yet. And I'm not put Parmesan cheese on it. Thank you. Shout. Ashley Roy got a fancy Trust! drink. Together now, dudes. We got the lemon. Box pie, me and Ryan solo eating. So each gin that we have here it has a different type of botanical herbs. Bombay has a ten different type of botanical herbs. Matthew 47 has 47. Jean Marie they have five different types of uh infused to get Good morning. I'm the only one up right now. Everybody's still sleeping. And we have to get off the ship in about an hour. So I forgot to do an outro yesterday, but yesterday urgent tasting was so good. Nur was amazing. Thumbs up to Nur. He's been working on the Disney ship for 25 years since one of the first, I forget which one is the first, The Wonder of the Magic. But anyways, he was fantastic. And dinner was amazing. They were a little bit late bringing Ashley's dinner out and they gave her a free drink just for the inconvenience, which was super nice. What else did we do yesterday? We went at bingo, um, $35, because we had to share our winnings with like six other people, but we had such a good day. It was our last day. We got a little sunburnt. Today is our last day on the Disney Dream. It is a sad day. We need to get out of our room. We missed, um, they usually take your luggage off the ship for you. So you put it out the night before, they take it, and then you just pick it up after you've disembarked. However, we were at a gin tasting and didn't realize we had to have them packed before 
10.30. So we are carrying off our luggage. That is the first time we will be doing that. Might be a little inconvenient since we have to go eat breakfast, but that is what we're doing this morning. So come with us on our sad last few hours on the Disney train. Oh, you'll see us real soon, Mickey. Don't worry. Mickey just said it very politely. They're also never going back to the <laughs> We were just told very politely, please get off the ship. <laughs> um, it's 9.30. So we're hoping that we're just going to walk very slowly because there's still a huge lineup. I don't see the point in walking down there and waiting in the line. So slowly making our way off the ship. One last bathroom break, but look how cute these bathrooms are. So cute. The kids are sad. We're leaving. Mike's sad too. <laughs> We're all sad. We don't want to leave. I would love to live here. Gonna go hungry here. Coconut shrimp, corn. I was still eating from this. What did Ryan order? Ryan got the lobster smoothies. Side of deviled eggs. Look at this sandwich. Holy smokes. Good thing I'm sharing with Mike because there's no way I would ever. Mike's taking a picture because this freaking thing is ginormous. Good thing I'm sharing with Mike because I don't think I'd eat that at all. So our flight was supposed to leave at 9.30. It got delayed till 10.40. Um, so we don't get home until almost two o'clock in the morning and I have to work tomorrow. So it's going to be an interesting day, but we're all tired. <laughs> so we got delayed again. We're now leaving at 11 that means we're gonna get home at two-ish 
Um, I'm already really tired. <laughs> I didn't want to leave the Disney ship, but I definitely want to leave the Fort Lauderdale airport. It is 11.02 and we are finally boarding our airplane. That means 12.12. We should be home close to three o'clock in the morning. I don't have, I have no words. I have no words, I'm gonna be very tired. Take a picture of you. Tired? I'm so tired. From the background, you can see that I made it into work with only maybe three hours of sleep. So we are tired. We are gonna be drinking a lot of coffee. Um, overall, it was such a good trip. It was such a good trip. Um, I didn't want it to end, but at the end I wanted to get out of the airport. Um, but I just wish, five days is just not long enough. Um, definitely if you're considering a Disney cruise, seven days is the way to go. Uh, however, Budget wise, sometimes the five days is all that you can permit yourself and a Disney cruise is better than no Disney cruise. I hope you enjoyed our vlogs. If you haven't seen the whole vacation, make sure you go check out the Disney Dream playlist. If you love our vlogs and you like catching up on what we're up to, please don't forget to like and subscribe to our video. It just helps us continue and it just helps me know what you like to watch. I'm ready for bed and it is only noon. We'll see you next time. Have a great day.